Okay, you clicked this video, so that means you want to know if Unreal Engine really is free to use. The short answer is yes. The longer answer is that like many things in life, it's not as straightforward as a simple yes or no answer. So if you're here for the full answer, hi, I'm Shane, this is Game Dev Academy, and in this video we'll be discussing under what conditions Unreal Engine is free to use, and also when you'll be expected to pay. First things first, to get a full and accurate answer we need to go straight to the source, Epic Games. On their website it says that Unreal Engine is free to use for creating linear content like films and for custom and internal projects. It's also free in many cases for game development. A 5% royalty only kicks in if and when your title earns over 1 million US dollars. Let's break that down a little then. The first thing it says is that Unreal Engine is free to use for linear content, and then they give the example of films, but this could also apply to TV, commercials, web video, and other similar formats. So that means that if you're Jon Favreau and you want to use Unreal Engine to create virtual sets for The Mandalorian, then it's free to use. No clauses or strings attached, no royalties to be paid down the line, they give you full access to the software, and you just don't have to pay. They also say that Unreal Engine is free for internal projects. What that means is that, let's say you work for a company with lots of remote workers and you don't want to use Zoom for your meetings and don't really want Zuckerberg tracking every aspect of your life in their metaverse, so you decide to create your own virtual meeting platform using Unreal Engine. You build the solution in-house and it's only used by your company. You're not selling it to anyone else as a solution so it can be classified as an internal project. Well, if that's the case, then Unreal Engine is completely free to use. Congratulations, you've just saved yourself hundreds of thousands or even millions of dollars that you don't have to spend building your own engine or platform. What about custom projects? These are projects that don't fit neatly into other categories like games or films. For example, Leeds College of Music used augmented reality to teach their students about a mixing desk. This is the type of custom project that Unreal Engine is free to use for, so go ahead and get creative. What about games though? Games are still the most popular use case for Unreal Engine, surely then it's not free to use Unreal Engine to make games. Well, it is free to use if you're developing games. I know what you're thinking, Tim Sweeney has lost his mind. How on earth is Epic Games going to make any money if they don't charge for anything? Well, first of all, they make plenty of money selling skins and backbling to preteens on Fortnite, but they do actually charge game developers for using Unreal Engine. Wait, didn't you just say it was free for game development? Alright, fictional commenter, call your jets. Yes, they do charge a 5% royalty for game development, but this only kicks in if your title ever earns over 1 million US dollars. So for me, Unreal Engine is 100% free for game development, because there ain't no way I'm ever making over a mil from any game I create. But let's say I did make a million dollars, I'm feeling pretty happy with myself, and I'm more than happy to give Epic 5% for providing me with the technology that my success has been built on. As an added bonus, your first million still remains royalty free and you'll only have to pay the 5% on any profits made over $1 million. So in conclusion then, Unreal Engine is free to use for linear content, internal projects and custom projects. For game development, there's a 5% royalty that only kicks in if your title earns over $1 million US dollars. I hope this video has answered any questions you had about the freeness of Unreal Engine. If you have any more though, let me know in the comments. Also, why do you think Epic makes Unreal Engine free in most cases? Are they just really cool, or is it part of some sinister overarching business plan? I'd love to hear your thoughts on this, and don't forget to like this video and subscribe to Game Dev Academy for more great content, and check out the video that's linked on screen for more on Unreal Engine. Thanks as always to my patrons, you guys are doing God's work, keep it up, and I'll see you all in the next video.